Hello everybody and welcome back to Dickie's videos. We're no war game of course remains unplayed. Further ado here we are. The magical wand has been lifted. Of course the new upcoming master of magic. Remember that ma that classic uh, is currently free on GOG at the time of this video and I've got to say I'm looking forward to this and of course as a massive Slytherin fanboy I love all their games they create so we, we are of course uh, the, the remake will be available on the 13th of December, so we've got a couple of months uh, to go. But here we are. Of course, check the link to the Steam store, and also, uh, of course, click the like and subscribe button. We have 100 turns of magic. We're going to have a look at all the ups and downs, and then we'll jump into the game as we go. So here we are. We've got new game. We've got, of course, the... Um, uh, easy normal and hard accelerating difficulties of course as you can see uh if the more harder you go changes the other options to as it goes so as we go, we'll go on easy so we've got wizard picks uh how many points you can spend in the spell books starting gold is what ai skill is what it says number of wizards uh neutral armies layer defense so strength of neutral armies defending magical intensity special events so of course anything that happens in the world Battle movement cost and world size. Let's have a look. So there we go. Max two full cost. Uh, so what? See so what? So on hard it will change that, and of course it will change the score. So we'll just click it on normal, uh, on easy, and then we'll continue. We'll have a look at the wizards. Of course, the famous Merlin himself. Great, great. Gotta say straight away, the art for this game looks absolutely amazing. So we've got Raven, which we can't click, and Sheer. Dabbles in the darkness of magical arts combining chaos and death magic. She's accomplished voodoo priestess. Despite her deceptively young visitors, she's said to have cheated death many times over. Oh, bro. And then we have Shoes. Looks like a lizard. That's a crafting a lizard and a dragon. It is a draken warlord, species of both chaos and life magic. But today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go with Merlin. And we're going to have a look what spells and magic stuff he has. So we've got life spells and uh, nature or spell books. Spell also to research new spells. Each spell book adds plus one power. Each starting spell book adds two casting skills. Every spell book above seven adds 10% to the research points. Invested into the disciplines, the spells, the domain, and reduces the casting. So... This is what we have. We have nature, as you can see. We have, of course, we're going to, click back to, we'll go back to uh, Merlin again. He has the tree life and nature. So this is, of course, what we start with and what we can change into. So we've got four points. Can we deselect to change? Yes, we can. So we can actually now customize our wizard any way we like. So we've got bless, blessing divine, add to the targets for resilience to armor. We have star fires, uh, enemies strength 15. So what else do we got? We've got a uh, holy weapon. We've got healing. Do you know what? I always like a healing spell, I will say. And just cause uh, is an active caster, uh, broadcaster, always of fame, increasing 10%, reduce it, and rest. That could be, and, and also we haven't got any uncommon. I think we need more, but I think we need to edit the uh, the frontal, what we're gonna, the frontal spells. So we've got, I wonder if we actually take these down, how much do these. I don't know how we would unlock the common, so we've got to just pick six spells here. So we'll go uh, Earth Law, and kind of should allow you to listen to whispers of the Earth spells reveal a place of interest. That would be good. Uh, water Walking, Stone Skin, well, War Bear sound fantastic, and Web and Wall of Stone. So select Race and Banner. So it seems that we only have the Halfling at the moment in time to select. And of course, uh, it seems like we can select our flag there. So of course, we've got the um, modifiers for the uh, uh, for the halfling growth regular, uh, building restrictions, build armor, skills, deal with shipyards, of modern men, it's a melee attack, plus two visit to lucky units, except construct, spearmen, sword, and bowmen production. And of course, we have the options of barbarians, gnolls, high elves, clactons, nomads, lizardmen, orcs, and highmen. And of course, the Mirren races, of course, Beastman, Dark Elves, Draconians, Dwarves, and Trolls. Brilliant. So let's just click this flag here and begin. So, like I said, we're going to spend a couple of videos as we are playing this. Don't, uh, like I said, always click the like, subscribe button, and we'll always uh, come back for more Slivering content. Absolute banging so far. Of course, I've got to say I'm a massive fanboy of Slivering and all the stuff they do. Uh, but like I said, kudos to the devs, as always. They... I'm sure they put a lot of hard work in there, and they always do. And I always watch the Home of Wargamers uh, to see the upcoming fantastic things there. So, 
I'm looking forward to the map. So, welcome, a oh great Merlin. Could you spare a moment of your time on the lonely cert? I would present you with the Muppet Pedro arrival, and we will go for the tutorial. So, definitely, uh, straight away, ladies and gentlemen, very, very smooth. We've got, of course, the AWD key. As it goes, we can see next thing. So, left click your location, right click to select the army in the map. Okay, there we go. So, each army orders every turn, wait, where they feel, wait, wait, and geez, God, makes sense. Double click on the city view to manage it. And here's the city. So let's have a quick look at what we got here. So we of course have the tax rate, and of course increasing tax rate will increase unrest. We have the town, we have the, I'm assuming the gold production, population, the, oh I can't remember what the star was again. I remember it, the food, unrest and a protection of this. And of course the units in there, we've got halfling settlers and halfling swordsmen. If we look towards the top, we've got gold, mana, food consumed, a fame, course who we are the max populations wizard info cities armies magic diplomacy and game options and of course report books uh oh i like that i like that. i like the kind of magic thing so we've got farmers so we can i think this is where we can actually put people into positions so you cannot lower the number of farmers below the minimum oh god when are we actually Oh, there we go. So we've got consumed. You can't put it below what you consume. So you always have to produce and consume. That makes sense. Oh, it's um, power income, the 11 is. So power is used to generate mana, research, or spells. We've got manage, uh, so construction queue. Uh, housing for additional housing, city followers, allowing greater growth. Uh, that causes everything. So let's see. Here we go. So this is what we can build. So let me just do that again. There we go. So we've got halfling units. We've got, we'll take that off. Ooh. Okay, construction. Uh, this place allows you to set up the construction queue for the town. Pick either the building on the left or units on the right. There we go. Should we build that? Is that 15 to, oh, it's three turns. There we go. And close. Brilliant. So we've got some settlers on there. Let's end that. So we've got cast a spell, research spell. So look at the spells we can do. Spells are a central part of the uh, Flight Arcane Supremacy. And become the master of magic. To expand the spell selection, you need to do research. Like to limit the eight spells become available in the progress. Remember, spell mastery is your final goal. The only appear of the research mode of spells. Acquiring new spell books give you spells of research. Research takes time. How dependent on remember the research points you produce spells the complexity. The more powerful spells are take longer. Makes sense. So, which we got? Resist elements, guardian spirit, dispel magic. Let's go for the guardian spirit. And there we go. So, let's see what spells, if we can cast any spells. So, we've got bless, earth floor, web. I want the war bears, but how much mana is that? So, that's going to cost me, costing 70. Oh, well, God, that's that's actually rather pricey. Uh, we've got bless, just cause. That was life cause, royal fame increase. Let's cast... No, we can't cast that because that. Gee, that is a lot of mana. That is a lot of mana. And we're improving for a turn. And of course, so we've got here, so all spells. So we've got summoning spells, unit spells, and other spells. And we have all spells. So we can actually look at that. It's like a little page tab. I like that. Um, Yeah, we've got settlers. So what do the settlers do? That may sound silly. So you can find these information about a particular unit and the statistic. So we've got melee. For, so. Is that four? So a chance to hit is 40%. So I assume the spells we can change around things there. We've got ranged, armor, resistance, uh, figures, number of individual characters, hits, ammo, mana, movement, uh, upkeep, and upkeep. So, of course, we're halflings, so we have the lucky rule there, don't we? Uh, and that seems it. Let's have a look at the uh, the warrior, the swordsman. Got to say, kudos to the art. Of course, I can just notice the experience, uh, what we get there. And, of course, slightly better. Uh, on the left of the units, race spell, both casters, equipment, items, and heroes. If your deems unit will keep too expensive, you can disband it. Makes sense. And finally, you can see the spells, which we have, of course, for the thing. Got large shield, 2% against all ranged attacks. Okay, so Q complete, which we've done. Um, research available. So now this, let's just go back to that again. So that was, I'm sure we clicked uh, to research that. So that's 
protective aura. And now the question is, as Mr. York hasn't played this before, there's the end turn button. Okay, so there we go. I see you've already found the end turn, Your Grace. Uh, still useful multipliers want. Uh, so first today's handy tool will tell you about the tower you hover over. So tab. Oh, there you go. Grassland. Oh, that makes things a lot better. And tells you what benefits or negatives are on there. So this is a grassland. Uh, abandoned keep unexplored. Uh, you should also know the switch between uh, arcane and P. Oh, God. Well, this is the... You should know how to switch between the uh, Arcus and Mirror. Press P and we will, we will before units can free to travel between planes. Oh, my God. There's another plane. A plane of magic. Uh, you need some more detail. Oh, God. <laughs> Ask. This is going to get big. And the map is quite big as it is. Uh... So a tower stands before you. Perhaps at home of some mercenary force. Bandit Lear. Whoever occupies it, surely the treasure's at hand. Uh... Enter. You keep abandoning and freely claim any treasure. Plus 14 mana. Okay, what's... Nothing goes wrong when you enter a, a place. So beware, it may be guarded. Oh no! We have found skelly mobs. I see... Uh, Considering a skirmish, Master. Let's see what to expect. So, God. Oh, this is not good. Do you want to command Percy or leave it to me? Yeah, I think... Uh, <laughs> your army will lose, your army will lose this the, lose the battle and there'll be no survivors. Uh, I think we're not going to engage the free skelly bobs because they seem quite tough. So what's have a look at some of them. Let's look at the actually the rules. God, they got melee, natural enchantment, hit chance, cold, missile. So they're immune to pretty for undead. You would expect them to be immune to a lot of things. I don't think we're going to engage that. <laughs> Uh, can we actually cast a spell yet? I, I want the the bears. I want to raise some bears. But I, I can't. Okay, let's go to this, uh, the, the rock. Oh, we produced our swordsman. So that's brilliant. So these are halfling spearmen. They've got lucky, melee, and of course XP. Very similar stats to the swordman. So, Master come gives to Ophius Barrett Spidget the great scouts and one more cog of the power, the node. Ba -da -da. Ooh. Yes. So, you accept it, she'll give you a spirit and consider choices another. Take the spirit. I want my bears. Whoa. Okay, dark seeds behind beneath the dangers lurking in the dark. Oh, 17 gold. We're going to go and try for them uh, skeletons, I think. I want my bears. I want my bears. Not just yet, Mr. York. We'll go and get them bears. Ooh, God, it's quite dramatic. And the war beasts have been summoned. Just the bare necessities of life. Uh, let's go for heroism. Let's go for. I want to like just cause. Can we, no, we can't cast that because we just zipped all of our mana. Oh, there's, is there an undo button? No, there isn't. Oh, we could build outposts, build road, and purify. Huh? Right. Let's see. It's 50%. I'm going to engage that personally. Okay, so at the moment in time... Oh, God, we're, 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 we're right into it. And also, so let's have a look what we've got here. So, I see you've chosen to lead the troops personally to battle. A few words of advice. Defending the group on the left, the attacking group on the right. Defenders always go first, and if they win, not if it win 50 turns. During your turn, you can issue orders and the actions. So, wizards participate in the battle can cast spells once per turn. Do to provide enough mana, spells, power to attack. Sometimes your forces are too strong and may be wise to retreat rather than face death. Be warned, escaping result in heavy losses. If additional expression and mechanics, please look at the notes. And good luck. So, we've got our magic here. I don't want to misclick because I'm. 
So we've got mana. Oh, because we can cast the spells from our, our thing, so it's costing us five. Oh, God, five mana, unfortunately. We've got. I don't know if we actually still generate mana. So what's their movement? So I want to see what their movement is. It's two. So one, two. So if we should here. I think the uh, <laughs> I think you're going to go away. We'll send the cheap chaff in first. Um, I wonder if we have to move or use all our points. Oh, you just press enter and turn. Yeah. And are we gaining ma No, we're not gaining mana. See, the mana you have is what you keep. So we'll go here. Okay, so I have a couple of the stats. So did he take any damage there at all? <laughs> I thought we came off horribly worse. <laughs> with these skeletons. <laughs> oh, you know what, Mr. York? I'm going to flee. I've got to flee. There's no way I can win that. Oh, that was a bit harsh. That was a bit harsh. <laughs> I, thought we, I thought we were stronger than it. Let's go and build a... Uh, <laughs> that was so bad. So trade good. It'll just put it, oh, so that's the default thing. So library, armory. So we'll build some more halfling spearmen. Jeez. That was a whooping. A caster whooping. Um, yeah, we need to think about <laughs> what we do. Oh, so we found a node. What are the tasks? Uh, so a node of plates of magical weather controls it. They're tapping the power of game for themselves. Nodes of the various of nature, chaos, sorcery, what are the creatures and spells? To conquer the node to road, first need to defeat the protectors. Only two creatures can in the spirit garden in summon spells of thing. Yes. And that means we cannot attack there. Oh, oh. Got some orcs that want to join us. So their agility. Oh, a hero. I think that sounds fantastic. Yeah, losing that settler thing is not great. <laughs> Okay, let's do a little bit more exploring. Oh, a castle. Okay, let's explore the castle. So, treasure behold, plus mana. Fantastic, that gives us... Which mana have we got? We got ten. Oh, God, we got no mana at all. I somehow think we have to conquer them nodes to get anything here, to be honest with you. Okay, beware the power likely guardians. <laughs> Your army will lose this battle. Jeez, things do things are mighty killy here. <laughs> Let's see what's on this other node. Oof. 
What's their stats? <laughs> Ten bloody hit points. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, allow your familiar to use mana to increase the chance of victory. I think it's like 100% death. <laughs> it just, <laughs> just things, things just want to kill you, Master of Magic. And the skeletons are quite. Ooh, I like that. Things people just want to join you. Some sexy barbarian uh, bowmen. Jeez, looking at our units, they are not as good. I can see how magic will influence all these real battles. So, ladies and gentlemen, we've come to the end of this video today. Of course, hit that like and subscribe button. Please check out Master of Magic on the uh, on course, the link below. And, of course, click the like and subscribe button. Of course, we're going to be continuing to play this. And let's see if we're not going to get absolutely trolled by skeletons, fireballs, and other bad things. Take care, and I'll see you tomorrow with another video. And bye-bye.